Um, I think this is what is needed for Pinellas County, for the Tampa Bay region. And one of, I think two, maybe all four of our, my colleagues have said, PSTA, it's going to be in your court now. You're asking a lot of people to step up for you. You're going to have to be a very good steward. During the course of the project, in fact it happened early, early on, PSDA project manager Mark Knight uh, verbally, the word we would use, assaulted our project manager. Uh, we ended up replacing that manager to try to change the chemistry, if you will, between PSTA manager and our manager. Um, it happened again with our new manager, and it really set a course for this project. We spent 18 months building a project under a very adversarial set of circumstances. Um, and again, I, I believe there's a benefit for you to hear this. I went to Billy Johnson, who was then the maintenance supervisor. Uh, Billy's response was to take a contract with me in a room, basically slam the contract to the table and said if, if we didn't back down, he would make sure that we would uh, feel the pain. So we, uh, we being Pepper, effectively had no choice at that point but to let the concerns for the project management by PSTA uh, sort of stay down at the project level. Mr. Bradford came on board in February of last year and I, I met with James to pass on these concerns. Um, it got a little bit better, but basically through the whole duration of this job, in 33 years of public works contracting, we have not worked with a more dysfunctional, adversarial project management. 